Alright, hello and welcome to another Marvel Snap deck highlight. With the new card they released yesterday, they also updated two card text boxes, one of those cards being Hellcow. He is now, I guess it's more than just the text box, they just like completely changed the card. He's now a 4-6 with Activate to discard two cards from your hand. So it used to be an on-reveal ability, now it's an Activate. Uh, I think it's a very strong change. Um, I don't think it's crazy necessarily, but I do think it is a, a very strong and very good change that he received. Um, the most important thing is he's going to be able to guarantee, I'm gonna put guarantee in air quotes, hit uh, cards you want him to hit because you can play Hellcow on four, play Modoc on five, and then activate after the Modoc. So whatever cards benefit from getting discarded, they're still going to be in your hand. So like that Apocalypse and Swarm in the scenario that we're looking at right now, um, you're still going to have those in hand when you have Hellcow. So his Activate will hit them again. And, you know, you're just going to profit. It's just good. Ah, oh, no, my deck. Oh, no. Why would you do that? That's so not nice of you. Oh man. Um, so contemplating playing Gwenpool middle. That's kind of uh, where the vibes are right now. I could Gwenpool middle, Modok middle, and then Apocalypse middle. But then if I pull Dracula, I'm pissed. So, you know. But I think the benefit of getting Gwen pulls on reveal twice is like outweighs it, maybe. We can get some swarms cooking. That would be nice. Oh shit, there are some? Since when? Seems fake. Dude, like, I'm just. I. I like. Like, you know? Like, like, my boy. It's fine. Minions to me. Hell yeah, hella Emperor Hulkling. You go, girl. Dracula. Um, but a bum 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 We certainly do lose to Shang. Victory. But guess who ain't got no Shang? That guy did. I mean, the other side of the thing is the other side of the thing, the coin. Is that uh you know it's just discard you don't you don't need hell cow it's just kind of good you know get the right cards it's just good also cards to add if you have Proxima Midnight she's she's really good Should probably put her in the deck it's your TSA also subscribe you're welcome all right game two maybe we get the cow. Also I will let you guys in on a little secret. The other card that got changed to an activate ability, I'm not what they did. I was advocating for a while that that change should have happened without the activate change. And I'm mad that it happened when they got the activate change, because I think they definitely got worse with the change and the activate. But I will explain it more in the next one. Um, is it Hot Zone Sinister London? Uh, location says do I want collector in sinister London I mean maybe but also maybe not. all right we're not uh, we're not gonna kill monger that would be silly we're not 
gonna do anything. It's what we're gonna do. Um, you know, like, uh, you know, cards, things. Go left. Left. Nice. Um, we did fit, um, um, well, the thing is, we do that, and then we can hell cow, we just pray we get apocalypse in the next two turns, and we don't pull swarm. They needed four extra energy. Need Alright, we need the next we need the next two X-23s. When they both get killed by Killmonger here, we need them to both bounce middle. Middle. Nope. Don't go middle. Damn it. Uh, I mean, I guess we do this. Uh, and then we just, like, Modoc middle, close our eyes, hope for the best. Like, I don't know. I don't even know how big this apocalypse is going to get, but I'm going to guess pretty friggin' big. Is it going to beat a null middle? Is he gonna beat a null? Oh, okay, that's not Venom, so it's cool. Um, X-23 go anywhere? Nice. Nice. Don't do it to me. Fuck it, we ball. I don't know. I'm not going to do the math on this. But, I mean, it's going to... We don't win right, ever. Oh, you coward! You coward! You coward! Um, it would have been 8 plus... 8 plus 16, so it would have been... 32. This one would have gotten 36. Because I think it resolves on place order. This one would have got 36, this one would have got 40. You absolute coward. And our <laughs> collector would have gained... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So he would have been at 10. Ah! I just want to see the big apocalypse and everyone's just stealing it from me! <sighs> Let's say you know it's a good card, though. People aren't even letting you see it. Alright, this is gonna be the real test of the deck. The I, I, I didn't check. I forgot to. It has to be, though. Like, there's just no way that that keeps running up, like, coming up without that. Um, top 5k player. Give me something good. That's so trash. So tragic. Um, yeah, I mean, we're looking for apocalypse, swarm, magic would be good. Any of those? That's good. It's really good. Um, I'm like a hesitant to even discard this swarm. I think I do it because Gwenpool's gonna not be nice at all. And we're gonna Gwenpool Sinister London. Please don't hit both of them. Oh man. Oh, oh dearie me.
Alright, go suck a dick. Uh, yeah. <clears throat> You're a real cool guy. Look at me. I read Guardian the Collector. Oh boy. Suck my nuts. I know your rogue got discarded. I know you're a freaking coward. I'm not afraid. God, I just imagine how big the collector would have been. I mean, whenever the Mojonk wants to actually start discarding the cards, you know? It's cute, it's cute. <laughs> cool. God, when these guys are the coolest kids in town, that's running Red Guardian, Rogue, and Shang. Holy heck, what a cool guy this guy will be. Surely not, right? Surely this is just a surfer deck. Surely. Ain't got nothing on me. Victory. Nothing. Think your Gwenpool's cool? Maybe have a better fucking two drop in your deck, huh? Beat a 224. I dare you. Can't. Can't do it. I'm too good. Alright, hopping into game four. We cannot blade tragically. Hello? Um. I mean, we could blade. So I'm actually going to blade this turn because if it is hot location, Sinister London, then we would rather Mobius. Morbius into the Sinister Land. I am reborn. Opponent snapped. <laughs> uh, it's technically better to play Collector. In case somehow we end up with a card in our hand, like it, it really shouldn't matter. Um, and for the logic that it really shouldn't matter, I'm gonna play Morbius. It is Hella. We can Hellcow middle, and then we can Gwenpool Hellcow. Gwenpool, and then activate Hellcow. Um, assuming we don't pull anything better. I don't really know what would be better. Uh, yeah, I mean, this is actually exactly the better scenario that I was kind of worried about. So I was thinking about Collector Lady Sif would be a good curve, but I'm not sure it's good enough. Maybe it is. We can do this, this, this. Did I do that order right? I don't like how long it takes to activate. 
Obviously, like, you don't want to misclick or anything, but like, oh my god. Just let me... Just let me click it. That's... hot. Apocalypse. Um... They have a ghost like if they have a ghost rider that could pull back their infinite that they hit that's the scariest thing to me um because they get to like say where that goes otherwise like i want to throw one here this be tella um Minions to Minions me. To me. Gotta yeah, I wanted to. I wanted to cover if they played Hella Middle, because it could have been bad if they played Hella Middle, and then um, if Infinite went either side, they would have won. Um, so this covered that. I'm surprised they didn't play Hella Middle, honestly, um, because that was kind of the lane that they had to make me respect them, but they didn't, so it doesn't matter. Hellcat did kind of show his weight there. That's what I'm saying. Looks pretty good. You got a 20 power apocalypse with um, Hellcat Blade. Feels good. That's what I'm saying. And we're we're redeeming our rank a little bit. I tilted a little bit. I was playing Mill. Uh, by the way, Mill's fucking garbage. So don't do it. All right, hopping into the final one. All right. Well, that's not great. Yes, that's not, that's not good. I mean, that's not good for them either, so... We're riding together, I guess. No! You son Fire, of a gun. Daily Collector. Um... I'm not I'm not loving the cards I'm getting right now, but it's workable. We're we're certainly able to work with the cards we're getting right now. All we need is, you know, something good. Something to really make me feel like I don't hate my hand right now. Yeah, you show them. Just Deathlock left, I guess. They're in a Deathlock Savage Lands, probably. I had the option to do that, and I'm too stupid to have seen the play line. Are they running the same card backs as me? Am I delusional? They are running the same card backs as me. Uh. They destroyed a card? No. What's going on? Um we activate Ladies. Do we ever win? I don't think we ever win.
Because we only get get ten. And then we can't win seventeen middle though. That's a problem. We we couldn't win right and get seventeen middle. I'm not even sure if we could win right. There's, I, there's probably like a death lock here, venom here is what I would guess. Um, so we're just kind of cooked. And there's no way we get 21 power here. Anyway, I mean, we won four or five, so it's pretty good. And we lost to not Phoenix Force the Nuts, but it's pretty damn close. They had the Nuts. They did have it. Uh, they just got fucked by Sakaar. Um, so anyway, if you enjoyed, please like, comment, let me know, subscribe to your tech guides, and I'll see you in the next one.